What's up gamers and people who may have just stumbled onto the channel. I am Wolfluff and today I'm coming back after a one week absence for another episode of Wolfluff Complains. Now before we get into the topic of the video and the video itself, I have to ask you all to like and subscribe for weekly-ish videos. Also we are one sub away from 50 and 51 subs away from 100. I know it's crazy how that adds up. All right, now that everybody has liked and subscribed, let's get into the video. Now the subject that I decided to complain about this week, and this may trigger a few of you, as I know some of you guys are simps and actually like these people. I don't know how you do it, but the subject is e-girls. Woohoo, look at me, such an original creator who doesn't steal any of anybody else's ideas and doesn't copy off any other YouTube channels. So to start off, uh, there is a big distinction between e-girls and gamer girls and while I believe That I hate saying both of those words at the same time I also think that one is a very fair and viable strategy to grow your online viewer base and the other is completely reprehensible now if you were observant and looked at the title of the video you would probably have a good idea at which one I hate and good on you. You looked at the title of the video. A lot of people don't do that. They just look at the thumbnail. It's sad. However, if you are retarded and deaf up to this point, then let me point out which one I hate. Personally, if you claim to be a gamer and you stream a game and you play that game while just looking like a normal person, then I have no problem with you. Good, good you gotta pass. However, if you claim to be a gamer, or just an online personality and dress like you belong in a goddamn strip club, I already hate you. Especially if you stream on Twitch. I don't know, if you stream on other sites or you do stuff on other sites that are approved, uh, that are approved for this, then it's fine. Because that's what it's made for. But personally, these people, in my opinion, have no business on Twitch as they are not gamers and they are e-girls and are fucking disgusting. They're disgusting because they're marketing what is essentially softcore porn on a site meant for gaming. That would be like bringing a gun to a King Supers. Oh shit, wait, that actually happened near me, never mind. What I'm pointing out is that they are corrupting and destroying Twitch, which let me remind you is in case, you know, all the e-girls on the site have made you forget, is a site for gaming. It's for streaming video games. In my opinion, what they've done is also bullshit with some of the stuff like the hot tub meta, which has destroyed Twitch's integrity and has also propelled double standards with some of the inaction towards banning the individuals who are not following their terms of service. Also, anyone who comes after these e-girls and tries to criticize them often have to deal with an army of simp soy boys and cucks who are defending these brain dead individuals. The mere existence of e-girls has made it a problem for smaller streamers who actually are good at games also to grow on the platform. If you ask me what the actions we should take should be to stop them from destroying Twitch, well then I would say you should ban the e-girls from the platform altogether and bring back the pure rage of people like Tyler1, Yasuo, Ninja, TF Blade, fucking weirdo, and a lot of other league streamers that I didn't mention. Yes, that game is a problem. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video on why e-girls are the scum of the earth and should be banned from Twitch. And if you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Also leave a comment down below for the algorithm. And I will see you guys all next time. Bye.